When I was in university, I had a really keen interest in learning about people and society and looking at the biology, sociology, and psychology of communities, um, how people kind of operate, who they are, and all of that really interested me. I moved, actually I packed up my car with my dad and we drove across the country uh, and made the move to Toronto. Uh, I had no idea what to expect, I had no idea where I was gonna live, and uh, started to kind of create my path and my career here um, in Toronto. And I think at some point, I realized that I was on this elevator and it was it was traveling up and I was traveling up with it and I lost a bit of a sense of purpose for what and why I was doing what I was doing. Um, yeah, so my mom ended up getting really sick and um, she battled uh, and successfully beat breast, breast cancer. It gave me time to learn that I had become more of a values-led individual and it's kind of being on the hamster wheel and going through the motions in a career opportunity wasn't actually satisfying for me anymore. And you know, with that, I wanted to do work that was meaningful, that gave back, um, that helped people at the end of the day. But when I sat down with Colleen, I just got this real sense of authenticity and trust and realness from her and here I am. It was this really unique opportunity in that it brought the passions that I had for marketing together with the social impact space. So I can go from brand marketing and, and all things brand development to creating an entire corporate social responsibility program from the ground up. A couple of the more recent initiatives that I've been involved with um, were a Ukrainian housing support program where we welcomed um, over 150 Ukrainian families and, and individuals into our properties across the country. Particularly proud of that. The future at Hazelview, and for me at Hazelview, I think is, it's an exciting horizon that I can't quite put a pin on because the spaces I work in are so active and continually evolving and moving, which I love. Family becomes reprioritized in the list and has moved now to the top of my list. You're really smart about where and how you spend your time and I think investing my best self in my family um, has come through and I think it comes through because at the end of the day I'm really fulfilled by the work that I do and that then allows me to show up really authentically to my family. My name's Jasmine and this is my moving story.